Hey guys, how are you all doing? I'm Paul and this is Tech and Travel. So, I don't know where to start with this video to be honest. Um, I'm absolutely amazed that I'm stood here making this video today um, because what I have been sent is just mind blowing. So from a tech enthusiast point, I am so excited to be showing you guys what I have been sent and what I'm gonna get to unbox, play around with, it's, yeah, just mind blowing. I can't wait, I just, ooh, I'm so excited. And you'll just see for yourselves in a minute uh, when I show you why I'm so excited. Um, I've got to start off by saying a massive thanks to you guys because if it wasn't for you guys who watch the channel, I wouldn't be in this fortunate position. So thanks very much to you for watching and for uh, subscribing. And a really big thanks to the guys at Box who have sent me all this great tech, um, again, to further my channel and give me loads of stuff to mess about with, which is just amazing. So why have we got what I've got? Now, a few weeks ago, I asked you guys what TVs that you'd like to see me unbox in the future. And I spoke to the guys at Box and we came to the conclusion of a couple of TVs that we think will be hot um, TVs over the Black Friday period. So hopefully, if you are looking for a TV, that um, one of them might be the one for you. And hopefully I'll be making loads of content that um, will be beneficial to you guys if you're uh, looking to buy one. So uh, yeah, what I'm gonna do is start off with the big stuff and uh, gradually work down to uh, the other things at the end, but they're all great items. And yeah, like I said, I can't wait to get them unboxed and uh, start creating this content for you guys. So uh, yeah, if you like this video, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up. And if you want to see all these being unboxed, then uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So let's crack on. Right, yo then folks. Let's start off the first product, and that product is a 65 inch B9 OLED from LG. So I know a lot of you guys have been asking questions about the B9, and unfortunately I've not been able to answer them because I've never had one to try out yet. I had the C9 and I've got the B8, so it should be really interesting to uh, try this one out and compare it to my B8 because I've had this one a, a while now. So I know all the ins and outs of it. I know exactly what the picture quality is like, you know, what the TV is capable of. So yeah, it should be uh, really interesting to see, you know, what's been improved with it. Um, you've got a new, new processor in it this time around as well. So yeah, you know, is picture quality been improved and that? And I will be doing my usual unboxing, as I always do, showing you uh, everything about it, really. And yeah, I, I just can't wait to get it unboxed. So if there's any questions that you guys um, want answered or videos making about this TV, then please leave a comment below and I will try and fulfill your needs. So yeah, really excited about that. I think, you know, this is going to be a great tv over black friday i know the b8 was a real big seller last year along with the uh uh the c8 as well uh, so this is your, your entry level um oled from lg uh but you know should be great i mean my one is a, a great tv being the b8 model i was happy with that so yeah you know if you want to get into your oleds first time around sort of thing you want the latest model but the, you know lowest in the range then hopefully um, this might be one of the TVs for you. And yeah, uh, can't wait to get it open. So I think it's time now to move that out the way and uh, move on to the uh, next product. So let's crack on. All right then folks, are you ready for this? So next one up, here we go. I will shall I move this one out the way and the big reveal for A 65 inch Q90R 
from Samsung. Right, I'm going to take back over control of the camera now. So yeah, this I am really excited about because I have never owned a QLED. Now, a lot of people rave about them. Some people prefer QLEDs over OLED because you haven't got the burning risk uh, and so on. And a lot of people like the peak brightness on these. I think it's sort of, it's like 2000 nits on this one, I think, something like that. Um, I'll look in more detail when I do the unboxing of it anyway. So yeah, I think I will be able to make some amazing content with this because of the rivalry between the OLED and the QLED. I can maybe answer some of the questions that you guys have asked before when you've been undecided from one or the other and maybe settle some of those arguments. What's better out of a QLED and an OLED when it comes to certain things? So yeah, some amazing content hopefully to come with this TV. And uh, again, if you've got any suggestions of uh, content that you'd like to see, any comparisons, anything you'd like me to test it with, say Apple TV or consoles and such like, then uh, again, leave a comment below and uh, I, will try, I will try and fulfill your needs with that. But yeah, I can't believe I've been sent this. Um, I'm going to have the best of both worlds. You know, I'm going to have an OLED and a QLED. So yeah, I'll, you know, it'd be long-term sort of um, videos going on with this. This will start off in the lounge up here. So I'll give it a bit of a run in, in this room. And then it will be um, be moved to another room and where it will live then. And I can do long term reviews um, on how the, you know, sort of the TVs pro progressing over time. So, uh, yeah, cannot wait. So let me let me know what you think of it. And uh, yeah, let's uh, move on to the next product. OK, next up. Something different now, not a TV. I know a lot of you guys have been saying, hey, what about doing some other content that's not TV related? And I've got exactly that thing for you. So hopefully this uh, will be interesting for some of you guys out there. I know it's uh, a bit of a hot topic when it comes to tech. So uh, let's move this QLED out of the way and reveal exactly what it is. there we have it. We have a Segway. I'll take over the camera again. Nine bot scooter. So yeah, this looks absolutely great fun. Um, I've never personally owned an electric scooter. I've got an e-bike. But this, yeah, I've never owned one. And I know a lot of people are buying them at the moment. Uh, we've just come back from a holiday in Mallorca. And loads of people have scooters over there. It's, you know, I swear there's more people going around on scooters than there are on their feet. And uh, yeah, it's going to be great fun unboxing that. I'm going to be out testing it out. You know, I'm going to be the man about town on this beast. So yeah, um, please um, subscribe if you haven't and you want to see this being unboxed and tested out in the real world. And again, I'm going to be doing long-term sort of reviews on it so it's not just an unboxing and a quick test um i'll be doing follow-up videos in the future showing you like your uh, long-term battery usage going to try up some like hills to see what it's like how steep you can take it up a hill um i'm sort of pretty heavy um i'm pretty much on the weight limit so again it'd be interesting to see how that affects range again steepness or gradients of hills and that and uh, yeah, ge generally in the first video of the unboxing, we'd be having a look around it. It's got some lights on it, lights on the front, lights on the back, lights underneath. And yeah, a, a great gadget again for a gadget geek like myself to have a good play around with and something completely different from the uh, the TVs. So hopefully you'll uh, join me for the unboxing of that. Right, let's uh, move on to the next product. Again, this is something I've not really owned before. Well, I say I've not owned. I did own one for about a day and then I sent it back. So subscribers to the channel might know what this is. Uh, again, looking forward to this. So let's do the reveal. Mm, just a box. 
So we're going to have to crack it open. I'm going to move the other one out of the way there. The, the final one. And let's get this open. What could it be? I know my kids are looking forward to it. So. out of the way and we have an Xbox One X so again I'll just take over the uh, camera oh we've got a bit blue in the room let's uh, move this round a minute and uh, just knock this off on the TV because it's making everything look blue now it's looking green. <laughs> right, there we go, that's better. So yeah, um, you guys may have seen before, I actually wanted to purchase an Xbox One X, and I did, I bought one from Amazon. And a bit of a long story, but it had to go back because it wasn't as described. So yeah, really chuffed to get this. Never really had an Xbox then to play around with, because like I said, we only had it for a day. And reason for me getting this is that a lot of you guys when i've done um a recent video on oh, i can't remember what i named it now but it was to do with gaming and i used my ps4 pro and a lot of people commented saying you want to use an xbox one x it's proper 4k graphics not like a ps4 pro so the guys at box have sent me this it comes with a couple of games um well, we got battlefield there far cry new dawn so i'll be testing this out on the qled on the oled i will be uh i'll try and get the same games as well for the playstation so i've got uh the new call of duty for the ps4 pro i will get the call of duty for the xbox one x we will try both games and both consoles on both TVs, compare them side by side, that sort of stuff. So yeah, really looking forward to this. Kids are looking forward to playing with it as well. They've never played on an Xbox, so uh, it's going to be good for them as well. And once again, if you've got any suggestions of games that you'd like to be seen tried out on this, on whatever TV, please leave a comment below. Again, I will try and get hold of that game. Um, obviously, I can't do every single game, but, you know, the most popular ones I will try and get hold of. And, yeah, try them out on both TVs to see how each console with each TV compares. And, you know, may, maybe figure out which is the best combination of uh, console and TV. So, I think it's time to uh, now move on to the final product. Now, this is something um, you guys ask quite a lot about. Not this particular one but to do with the one on this TV. So, the last product is a TV bracket. And uh, not just any old one, it's a no gap wall mount. So anyone who's looking to buy one of these QLEDs, um, you may want to look at buying one of these. Again, can't wait to get this up, It'd be interesting to see how flat it actually does sit against the wall because that's one thing um with this tv at the moment i've got like an old bracket so it doesn't sit really close to the wall so it's be uh interesting to see in comparison how flat it actually does go so yeah looking forward to uh getting this on the wall and uh tv on it and all set up and hopefully uh yeah you guys will be interested in uh seeing that all set up as well So, there you have it then, folks. Hopefully, you're as excited as I am about uh, seeing this lot unboxed. Uh, I just can't wait, and I can't believe I've been sent it. So, you can now see what I was on about when I said about how excited I am about it all. I mean, it's literally like a dream come true. I just cannot believe it. I cannot wait to get it all open. You know, from a tech person's perspective, like I say, it is a dream come true, getting this much, much stuff to unbox, I literally don't know where to start. So yeah, um, 
If you want to see this lot being unboxed, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, there should be tons of content coming over the next few weeks. And if you've got any ideas of um, videos that you'd like to see or any questions that you'd like to ask about any of these items, then uh, please leave a comment below. And once again, a massive thanks to the guys at box.co.uk for sending me all this wonderful technology to uh, play around with and create amazing content, hopefully, for you guys. So a massive thanks to them. Um, so, yeah, I, like I said, I can't believe it. Um, it's a dream come true. And I, I just can't wait to mess around with this lot. And if you've enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up. And if you have not already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button to see all this wonderful tech uh, being unboxed, which will hopefully um, help you guys in any future purchases of any of these wonderful products. So thanks very much for joining me and hopefully I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.